what's going on youtube you feel me we back with another tier list i ain't been on my list game in a minute but these is really the go-to videos i ain't gonna lie this is really where the magic happens this is really where greatness is generated you feel me we about to rank all nba teams free agency now i don't have the list right in front of me so i might forget a couple of signings here and there but i know all the important ones <laughs> all the important and you know what we go we go factor in trades too because why not why not you know why not but count it all in there been supposed to make videos about the trades that actually happened but, or the, all the individual free agency videos but man paul george decided to sign on the freaking sixers at 3 a.m or that was never happening i was asleep every time even when mikhail bridges got traded i was asleep the fact that i didn't make a video for mikhail bridges at the time that it happened because i said nah i value my peace and my sleep should tell you how i feel about every other team in the association but anyway let's get straight to it and you know what why not let's factor in the draft too because that's that's kind of sort of free agency when you think about it the atlanta hawks uh, it's a mix of either tomfoolery or wake up i'll say tomfoolery because no 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 yeah it's tomfoolery because they, they should have traded dejounte murray earlier and they got what larry nash jr and dyson daniels in a, like a second round picks or was it second? No, i think they was like one first round pick or something like that but it wasn't that was very not valuable first round pick at all i don't remember who they signed but I mean, at the least, they're heading in a direction. They're heading in a direction. They got Risa Shea instead of Sar. Mm, I feel like they should have got Sar personally. I liked Sar more, but I understand why they got Risa Shea. I'm, I'm gonna put it in tomfoolery simply for the fact that they should have and could have done this way earlier, but they decided to stretch it and they decided to rush the process. And now we're here. Boom. Celtics. I would say cool little signings. Cool little signings. They made the extensions. They They ran it back. They didn't do anything revolutionary, but you're not supposed to do anything revolutionary when you, you win the title, unless you're the 2022 Warriors, you know, with, with that type of team where you, you, you feel me? That was kind of a last dance type of situation, but they did what they were supposed to do. They got guys signed up. They, they released some guys. I forgot. They released somebody. They waived somebody for, for to get more money. Yeah, they did what they were supposed to do. They're poised for another great run next season that is all the complimenting i will do this video brooklyn nets did we even do anything i don't remember us doing anything so i'm gonna just put us at wake up because <laughs> we didn't really do anything there wasn't really anything to be done so i'm gonna just put him in air i'll say if you didn't do anything but there wasn't anything need to be done i'll put you in air now if we count in the trades oh yeah we made some moves we made some moves but i'm not gonna count that i'm not gonna count that actually i changed my mind you know what no nah, i changed my mind again moves yeah got that man bridges up out of here you feel me we got our picks back and we we did we i think we waved like dennis smith jr or something i forgot we waved somebody we saw somebody we, we did what we were supposed to do for real for real for real hornets mm, i don't even remember i remember somebody that left the hornets or something like that what was it jalen mcdaniel that was always early out before or seth curry i think they they waved steph curry something like that where right? just wake up <laughs> do something fix it somehow i don't know how chicago bulls wake up why is DeRozan still on the team why is zach levine still on the team why is vucevic still on the team wake up wake up cleveland cavaliers they re-signed Donovan mitchell got him that extendo that's a good great little sign and you did what you were supposed to do for real for, for i'm not gonna lie cooked cooked up the question is are you gonna get garland up out of there or are you gonna just see what happens next season you trying to get, get do what you got to do with the new coach mavericks moves you feel me you got clay but you did lose djj but you i mean we all know they were gonna lose djj because they didn't have the money to resign him so i'm putting them on moves because i got clay that's a big move that's a big maneuver you feel me great money. and and y'all got rid of tim hardaway jr got quentin grimes got somebody they get somebody else i think like i feel like they got to be getting rid of tim hardaway jr <laughs> that's a move <laughs> as a move right now the nuggets yeah well, tom foolery bro <laughs> they're about to sign russ <laughs> they are they reggie jackson got up out of there what's they lose they just they signed jamal murray but obviously they're gonna sign jamal murray he ain't got the big, they lost kcp too so that's tom foolery i ain't gonna ask tom foolery bro that's definitely some Tom Foolery, bro. Detroit Pistons. Y'all got, <laughs> y'all acquired Tim Hardaway Jr., acquired Tobias Harris, acquired, who else did they acquire? I ain't gonna lie, that's enough. Tim Hardaway Jr. and Tobias Harris are both on your team. Wake up! Get up. 
it up. Golden State Warriors. Warriors. Y'all got rid of Clay. Y'all waved Chris Paul. I'm going to put y'all in air because y'all don't really do anything else. You know, everyone's talking about Lowry. Get Lowry. Lowry. How much would Lowry actually do for you? I don't know. But, I mean, he do. He would do something. But, I mean, it's looking like y'all about to have freaking Steph, Pods, Kaminga, Draymond, Looney. All right. It, Pods might come off the bench if they get a shooting guard or something. I don't know. Wiggins is Wiggins is gone. Tch, Wiggins is cooked. It's not looking very good. Now, do Orleans Pelicans for now. I would say Colossans, Colossans. You know, you got you got Dejounte Murray. You about to get rid of Jonas Valanciunas because that defense is not it. Even though he be a big bruiser, you did you did your little thug. Th you, oh yeah, you did not have Najee Marshall no more. That might start you into the air territory. But Najee was nice, but I was I would say they cool. They, they, they did a little thing. They did a little thing. We got they got some up. You feel me? I think he fits well with that roster. Now it's like, are they keeping B.I.? Are they trading him? When, how, what's going on with him? I don't know. We can find out. The Rockets. Now they got Green, Shangun. They did something else. I forgot. But they drafted. Who did they draft again? I, well, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot outside of. They drafted somebody. And I looked at the profile here. He looked like nice. So I was like, I'm going to put them in. They're, they're, they're cool. They're cool. They did something. I forgot what they did, but they did something. <laughs> hey, sirs. They got rid of Jalen Smith and they replaced him with somebody. What did they replace him with? I forgot. I know they had Miles Turner, Siakam. People were talking about Jairus Walker not getting minutes because somebody got added to the team. But I angle lie. I forgot who they got. They got somebody. And I, I looked at it and I said, cool little sign. So maybe this is a casual alert, but I remember the Pacers got somebody. I'm not looking it up. This is off the domer. The, the, whoever they got, I know they, they resigned Obi Toppin. That's a good move, a good, good move right there. All right, Clippers. Tom Foolery. <laughs> Tom Foolery. Y'all got rid of, lost Paul George for nothing after trading 800 first round picks and Shea for him. And you lost Brandon Boston, the owner of the Boston Celtics. But who'd y'all get? Y'all got freaking y'all resigned Harden and y'all got who did who did they get? I forgot I, I forgot who they got. Oh yeah, they got Nicholas Batum. <laughs> they got Nicholas Batum. That that puts them up above the get up tier because they got Batum in the fourth quarter. Put it in work in Philly. The Lakers, the fakers. Just like you worse than the flippers. Get up, bruh. Wake up out of your sleep. It was just the third day out here, but it's the fourth day now. You don't have an excuse. So nah, y'all did absolutely nothing. And they wasn't asleep either, like Pat Riley, who I'm just gonna put right there. <laughs> he was asleep. You you wasn't asleep. He was actively calling everybody. Now we got Shams tweeting random Lakers websites or random sources talking about the Lakers are interested in Kyle Kuzma, DeJounte Murray, Dorian Finney Smith, Cam Johnson. The only people that you have to trade, they don't want to trade. Like they're like Austin Reese is untouchable. <laughs> okay, I guess. Yeah, we're just gonna sign DeMar DeRozan to a MLE. I guess. <laughs> uh, Memphis Grizzlies. Put them in. They got Luke Kennard on a nice little deal. They, they did a little song right there. They did a little song. Walkie Bucks, get up, bro. Not only do you still have Doc Rivers, but what did they do in free agency? I don't think they did anything in free agency. Timberwolves, they got lost Kyle Anderson. And I'm, oh yeah, the Warriors got Kyle Anderson. That's who they got. Uh, Eh, Tim Wills lost Kyle Anderson. I hated to watch him on the court, but he was low-key effective. I ain't gonna lie. So they acquired Robert Dillingham. That man is nice. They lost Monte Morris. I'm put him in. Eh. The Knicks. They lost Alec Burks. Obviously, the Mikhail Bridges stuff happened. Hartenstein. Now they lost Hartenstein. I ain't gonna lie. Eh. <laughs> they lost iHeart. That tough. They lost iHeart. That tough. But then they signed OG Ananobi to the big bucks which yeah he should he should have got the big bucks so i'm gonna put him back up right here it's a really balanced you lost some and you won some thank god he's so awesome but, uh okc thunder they was making moves they got caruso they got i heart they re-signed wiggins and blah, 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 blah. what's his name isaiah joe yeah on oh, braids bro what is it the braids i like now i'm moving this down i'm sorry i had to be real i'm moving this down until we get rid of cam johnson and don't even finish it. Get rid of both of them, I'm not gonna lie. Orlando Magic. 
they got rid of Joe Ingles, but they signed Gary Harris. They signed Gogo Batazzi. They signed Wendell Carter. They signed Mo Wagner. We signed, kept him back. They signed somebody. I forgot. But I'm going to put him in cool. <laughs> I'm going to put him in cool. They did something. Sixers. They got Ubre back again. Eric Gordon back ag again. Question mark. They got PG, of course. They were, they, they were making moves. They were making moves. Now, are those moves moving for real, for real, for real? I don't know. But you know what? Let's just, let's just, let's get to it. They, they was making moves, bro. The Suns, the Buns. Eh. I got Monte Morris, I guess. And that's literally the definition of a cool little signing. Cool little signing. Portland Trail Blazers. I lost Bragdon. Yeah, they traded him for something. I forgot. Uh, I'm putting him in. Because eh, I don't even remember. If I don't remember, I say eh. Kings. Y'all got the worst player in the NBA, Jalen McDaniels, on your team. So that's automatically. And y'all lost the real D. He's not even the real D. Mitch because he can't even get a bucket. And y'all lost Sasha Vazhenkov because you weren't playing it the right way. Yeah, pick. The Spurs got Chris Paul. But yeah, I don't have to say too much. The Raptors. What else they do? Scotty Barnes. Oh, I, forgot. I, I, I don't remember. Somebody went to the Raptors. They lost. Nah, yeah, they lost Jalen McDaniel. So a cool little sign because they lost him. Utah, what did they do? They didn't do nothing. Wizards, depending on whether or not Kuzma leaves, I can go either here or here. So I'm gonna leave it here because of the Wizards. <laughs> so yeah, that, that is the tier list of free agency. It's 100% correct. You know, it could not be any better. You know, it might have factored a little bit of trades in the equation, but to be honest, I feel like this is just highly accurate as to how a lot of these franchises feel in the state of free agency. You feel me? Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know if I'm turping. Let me know if I'm tweaking. Thank you. Bye-bye.